Good morning everyone and welcome to your next virtual assembly. I hope you've had a wonderful weekend and have been able to enjoy yourself somehow. This week's assembly is going to be taken by Mr Walsh and it's all about times like these. Good morning everyone at Harris Wimbledon and welcome to my assembly. So today's assembly theme is times like these. Now I got inspiration for that theme from a song called Times Like These, which was actually re-released on the recent charity fundraising evening on the BBC. I just thought that it was a really appropriate theme for the situation that we find ourselves in. And one of the key lines from the song is actually, it's times like these you learn to live again. Now learning to live again is something we've all had to do. And as humans, we often live by our routines and by our habits. I know I've definitely had to learn to live again and completely change my routines. Now, one of your set routines would have been getting up, coming to school, but of course, your routine has had to change completely. You've had to learn to live again and find a new routine. And you have been doing so well. Signing into virtual registration, doing live lessons, submitting work on time. It's absolutely brilliant. It really is excellent. And all of your teachers are so, so proud of you. Now, if you're anything like me, you're probably really missing your friends. Those morning chats in the playground, the chat and the jokes at break time and at lunchtime. And, and something that I've actually done is I've been staying in touch with my friends and my family virtually. I've had to learn to live in a different way and stay connected in a completely different way. And that's actually one of my biggest tips is make sure you stay connected, connected to your friends. But all you have to do is learn to connect in a different way. Use social media. Yeah, I know you might not hear me say that very much and it might surprise you, but I actually really encourage you to use social media to connect with your friends in a positive way. Remember, always be kind. You can also just pick up the phone and call your friends. The other thing that this time has provided us with is opportunities. Now I've done the assembly in my garden today because I've rediscovered my love of gardening. Times like these have provided me with new opportunities. So over the coming half term, I want you to think about the time you have and how you can learn to live differently by having a go at new things. There'll be some new and exciting opportunities open to you when we return to school. Because times like these have required your teachers at Harris Wimbledon to provide you with the opportunity to learn in a different way. Stay tuned to our student bulletin for more information on the next stage of our virtual school. So all that remains for me to say now is stay safe, keep safe and learn to live again. Now to finish this assembly, I just want you to tell you how much all the teachers are very much missing you, but this won't last forever. The future will be okay and make sure you keep that in your head. That's something I've been keeping in my head. It just won't last forever. A great piece of TV footage that keeps reminding me of this is the BBC News presenters. I thought I'd show you that, so it would be included at the end of your assembly for you to watch. And remember, times will change. Following that, we have an excellent piece of music composed by one of our own students to show you. They should be really, really proud of it. So at the end of the BBC News presenters, you'll see David Sandland perform his rhythm composition. Really well done, David. So that is now all from me. Stay safe, keep positive, and remember Mrs. Jones is saying ace. Okay, ready. One day I will tell you there are no new cases. And I'll read that the Nightingale is closing down. We'll take time to reflect and remember those lives lost. And we'll hug our loved ones. Our kids will play with their friends and finally go back to school. We will see our colleagues again. Sport will return, whether you like it or not. Cafes, shops and cinemas will open their doors. 
One day, plans will be made and kept. And until then, we'll be here to help you understand what's happening every step of the way. <laughs>